my first New York show, and I have to say it's an extremely like amazing experience. I'm Vivian Tam. You're watching Shit Dog TV. Okay, day three fashion week. Where am I going? Today you have Jill Stewart and you have Vivian Tam. Am I still hitting Zach Post and later? You are. Awesome. I know we're all super busy. Um, this morning I hit up United Bamboo. They had a great show. Then I went to Adam, and he's amazing as usual. Um, and I have uh, Charlotte Bronson. Are we going to hit the after party with Charlotte Bronson? Of course we are. Right? Why yeah. wouldn't we? Yeah, so we'll have, um, on the blog, we'll have all the details for that. Perfect, perfect. Yeah. And what about the We Are Ann segment that we're filming? Oh, yeah. yeah, so I met up with Lisa Axelson. She's the head designer of our Ann Taylors, and she basically showed me the entire fall collection, which is what we're wearing. Um, it's in stores, so check that out. One of my favorites is the jacket I'm wearing, which is a silk stretch cloquet, and I love it because it's stretchy and super comfortable. It's got a little bit of a modern edge because it's got an asymmetric zipper so it can kind of have a cool downtown biker jacket appeal. But then it also has this you know, 40s French influence with the puff sleeve and, and the, the kind of vintage fabric inspiration. I love our camel coat. Uh, I'm obsessed with camel as a neutral in general this season so the camel coat to me is just kind of the perfect finishing piece. It looks amazing with anything. Jeans and a white shirt, throw it over your suit, over a beautiful dress. It's just the perfect outfit completer. And then I don't think any day is complete without a little bit of jewelry. So I'm, I'm a big fan of the entire jewelry collection and I think it's a fun way to dress up your ordinary work outfit and bling it up on a weekend with jeans and a t-shirt. <laughs> to Adam. Your collection is amazing as always. Tell me a little bit about the inspiration. Well, you know, my inspiration always starts with the Adam girl. Um, it's a girl that I have as my friends or girls I see out at night or during the day. But then I take a point of inspiration. And this season it came from a film by James Ivory called The City of Your Final Destination. And Charlotte Gainsbourg is in it. And she has this real uh, spirit and this real style of, of number one, self-confidence. Number two, simplicity but also a real femininity in how she's wearing everything. Uh, and I took that film and her real spirit and translated it into the collection for Spring Summer 2011. Tell me, um, what is your favorite piece that we're going to see on the, in the show today? You know, I have a few favorite pieces. Yeah. One of them uh, is right here. Sure. Uh, and it is actually... It's actually all glass, amazingly enough. I love that it's dressed up really easy at the same time. I think you don't have to be sloppy yeah. to be comfortable. And that's an important thing in, in what I do and in my look. We're backstage at United Bamboo talking with the designers Miho and Tui and tell me a little bit about um, the collection this season. Uh, this season like we we got like a bit inspired or we thought just in the Victorian time when they were like uh, rompers or bruma to go swimming pool uh, to beach. We thought that was a very nice image so we we got it from there and we also had some uh, like a water ocean nice painting looking color painting uh, some images mm -hmm. and we also got inspired so we just used this blue 
a bit of everywhere. Is it exciting be, being at Fashion Week and being nine months pregnant? Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> well, any day now you'll have a Fashion Week baby. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Well, have a good show. Thank, Thank you. you. We're talking with Charlotte Ronson. Tell me a little bit about your collection. The collection this season is inspired by a vibrant romance of Spain with lots of kind of like bright florals and ornate Moorish embroideries and detailing and juxtaposed with the androgyny of 90s grunge. So lots of like perfect kind of bias cut dresses and slouchy boyfriend socks and strappy stilettos worn with, you know, then kind of messed up and dressed down for the more of a disheveled look with like sweatshirts and hoodies. I'm here backstage with Vivian Tam. The first thing I noticed about your collection is all the detail. Let's talk about this amazing crochet dress. Yes, this is like an inspired, you know, the Jane Temple in India. I use lace to, to get the feeling of the Jane Temple. It was so beautiful because of beautiful intricate, you know, uh, craftsmanship. Mixing all the prints, and mixing fabrics, and mixing lace and everything. It's, not, it's about the woman that, you know, she's traveling, she, she go in and, and, and pick up the things from the flea market and mix them together. I want to talk about this uh, deconstructed chang sam. Yeah. This is well there is no chang sam, and I have these two pieces like uh, deconstruct and make it together become one piece. Yeah, you know, like she's like like in the free market finding all those uh, traditional costume and fabric. De I mean, deconstruct it, you know, and become make it into modern clothing. Mm -hmm. 